Oh, it's getting night again, which is fine because I'm going to head underground. I can't believe that I have seen so many things already. I mean, there were animals everywhere. I didn't expect it to be so plentiful. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to head into this gravel and dig underground, and hopefully I will find a cave or something. Stop making noises. Yeah, so many different things, and all these different noises that I don't know. It kind of reminds me of back in the day, when I first started playing Minecraft, and when I hadn't heard any of the noises before, there was something about the moans, or a certain moan that the zombie makes, and a certain um, moo <laughs> that the cows make, that kind of sounded f similar to me, so I was never sure whether I was hearing a cow on top of my head or a zombie. And of course this was when I first started playing Minecraft, so zombies were kind of scary. <laughs> Cows were kind of scary. <laughs> I don't know. I thought everything was scary back then. I mean, probably the biggest fright I have ever had in Minecraft was when I came up against something terrible underground. I <laughs> completely out of the blue, underground, I came up against a squid. <laughs> you just don't expect to see something like that. <laughs> and of course, all its all its like tentacles were flailing around. And I thought it was some kind of strange spindly spider or something, really different from the usual spider. God, it was horrible. Now what I've noticed already is that my inventory is getting kind of clogged up a little bit already. Now I will be doing some sorting out, but I mean I've got this green snake egg, which I kind of don't want to get rid of because I mean, it's a new item, I don't know what to do with it. I don't want to just throw it away. I mean, for all I know, it could be rare. It could be a 1 in 100 drop or something that I just happened to get the first time. Um, so, what I've been thinking is perhaps I should get this backpack mod. Um, it was just suggested. Um, and with... Because uh, Titty was saying that... Wow, did you see those blocks just float all the way up to me? That was strange. Titty was saying that it might be a bit difficult with me traveling so far and having so many different things to collect whilst achieving goals um, to actually manage all my space. So what I've been thinking is I'll probably, I'll have my inventory, I'll also have my ender chest eventually, that's definitely something to invest in, um, just so I can expand my inventory a bit. Um, and possibly a pack mule as well? Mm, I don't know. Pack mule is... It's a nice idea because they can they can carry stuff around for you, but also they will slow me down. Any animals or anything will slow me down along my journey. Um, uh, let's see. So I don't know whether I want to do that, but yeah, apparently there is this mod, there's a backpack mod, so that would increase my inventory and it would mean I could carry things around with me, and yeah, I might, I might do that. Um, hmm, it is a bit dark in this room. I want to go and turn a light on. Alright, I'm back. And I've got some iron. Um, it is a bit lighter in the room now. We've got one of those lights, one of those kind of energy saving lights where you turn it on and it starts off really dark and then as it as you leave it it kind of gets brighter and brighter and brighter but that means if you need light straight away then <laughs> you just turn the light on and you have to kind of wait for it to warm up <laughs> well, there's lots of iron here that's great i think i'm going to have a full iron set of armor straight away i think i might even have like tools and stuff so maybe this is all, all i will do underground uh... just for now because i really want to set off on my journey discover more about these biomes and stuff I mean that is kind of about what is that that is kind of what the the whole point of this series is about is exploring. So I don't want to get too bogged down underground yet. That will be something something for a future episode probably. But for now, I just want to see what's out there. And hopefully with that little break, it will be kind of light. Did you hear that? I think it's that thing again. That possible dragon. I think it was a dragon. I didn't even know there was dragons in this. <laughs> Full set of armor. I'm gonna feel so much better now. There we go. We are armored up. Huh. <sighs> I think we should go out there. We're gonna go out with it with an iron sword and we are gonna tear up the place. We need to grab the bull by the horns. I wonder if there's a bull. 
And I wonder if it has horns. Because <laughs> if there is, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to grab it. Okay. Got that. Uh, I will make myself a bucket, because I never feel at home without a bucket of water. So I'll have that in the right slot. I'm going to chuck some things out of my inventory, and then we're going to go up and tear the place up. I don't think I knew what I was letting myself in for. <laughs> um, although, I, oh, those are spiders, aren't they? I said I wanted string. Oh, okay. That's a thing. Good God, look at that. Is that like a werewolf? Or just a wolf? Or there's a zombie and there are spiders. I want the spiders. Come here, you. Ugh, don't... Good God, that is a werewolf! That is a werewolf! Look, it's standing up, and it's got arms and stuff. And don't bite me, because I don't want to become a lot... A, a, blah, blah, blah. It's got so much health! Okay, it's going crazy. <gasps> oh God, it's a man! I suppose it would be, because it... Oh! A werewolf! <laughs> and it just became light, and... I wonder if he's still angry at me. Right, hang on. And that's what all the roaring was about right at the end there, was that it was it was gradually turning back into a man again. <laughs> okay. I heard an Enderman teleporting. You. I, I would quite like a bow as well. Right. You guy. Are you going to attack me? Yes, you. Should we find out? Guy? You're hurting me! Stop. <laughs> Sorry. I <laughs> You're hurting me! Stop! Okay. Sorry about that. Let's get out of here. And I've got two string. I just need one more. I, I Maybe there's something up there that I can go and get. So many scary things already. What the f- It's not doing anything. Run! Run! <laughs> um, okay. Right, a creeper. I can handle a creeper. <laughs> he says. Oh boy. Right. Let's let's try and get back into the swing of things. Let's just talk about something. Talk about something to take my mind off it. <laughs> Look, there's another one of those scorpions. Let's move away. Huh. So. Oh! Is that a raccoon? Or something? I don't know. Something. Oh! So cute. Okay. I'm going to move through this carnivorous forest. <laughs> and, yeah. I... I, I, I've become aware that 1.7.2 is is out already. Um, oh, hi there. And I have got to decide what I'm doing because this is in 1.6.2, this game, and it's going to have to kind of remain in that. I think I might be able to update to 1.6.4. But any time I update, I've got to be... I mean, I'm, I'm slightly worried that something might happen to the world. Look, it's a, it's a house. Kind of looks like a witch's hut, but kind of in the wrong place. I think I want to go and check that out. Let's go up and along. I'm loving the, the big hillsness of this place. And look at these trees. I mean, what kind of wood is this? Fur. Ah! Oh! The Douglas firs! <laughs> That's funny. Um, I was just watching uh, Twin Peaks, uh, the first few episodes of. Um, we've we've had it for ages, and we've watched the first few episodes of it several times now. But now we're we're resolute, and we're going to be watching the entire series through, the entire two series, I believe. Um, ooh, a moor, apparently, and some rats, and some interesting dirt over there. I'll have to check that out. Um, yeah, and and the. One of the one of the main characters in there. Oh, look! It's a village, and another werewolf. I think. Well, I don't know if it's all of them are werewolves or what, but there we go. Um, yeah, in this. 
<laughs> bouncy bounce. In Twin Peaks, the one of the main guys, I think his name is Agent Cooper. Um, he's fantastic. He he's he's one of the main reasons to watch Twin Peaks. I've got to say, he's fantastic. Um, but he he he's completely in awe at, at a lot of things, mainly pie. But he um, he loves the trees in Twin Peaks. He he, he he's amazed by them and, and he's, he's asking like everyone like what's the trees here and they're Douglas firs so they are that kind of tree and they are amazing I mean look at that that that's a fantastic forest there I'm gonna really enjoy going through all these different biomes and and finding out everything there is to know about them it's also nice that every time I move into a different biome it it pops up the achievement telling me where I am however the bad thing about that is that every time I change jar I will lose my achievements. Oh! What? <laughs> huh. So it's kind of an ogre, I think. A two-headed ogre. It's carrying a club. They're both... Yeah, they're carrying clubs in both hands. Oh my. It's a zebra. I'm just going to stay away from things like that. I imagine I will need some enchanted armor before I go after anything like that. And you... Chickadee, come here. I want your feathers. So, back to what I was talking about ages ago. <laughs> Which is going to be a feature of this series, I'm sure. I'll just carry on forgetting what I'm talking about. Um, culture and so is, it looks exactly like a witch's hut. I'm going to go down here, see if I can commandeer anything from the village. Um, 1.7 is out. I'm in 1.6.2. I don't know if I can update yet. I certainly can't update to 1.7 yet, because obviously that has just come out, so the mods won't be up to that. And when they do, the one worry is that I don't know what will happen to my world, so I'll probably have to make backups and stuff before I do anything like that. Um, but here's the thing. This is the thing I, I have been talking about for so long, ever since I heard about it. 1.7 means that there is a it's a crow. A sprint key. A sprint button. Oh, it's a baby donkey thing. It's a foal. Um, a sprint key, which means you don't sprint fail or anything like that. You can just you can sprint and you can hold it down. You don't have to double tap. It, it's just amazing. However, I'm going to be carrying on changing between 1.6 and 1.7. There's a zombie in this house. Hmm. Um, hey guys. Yeah, and there's... Oh god, that's a bear, isn't it? Yep, that's a bear. I'm gonna go out the front of the house. <laughs> I'm not here. Um, oh, let's get out of here. <laughs> I think that's that's going to be the title of this. Let's get out of here. Let's carry on moving. See, this is why I'm heading towards like 100 miles away. I'm not actually trying to reach a destination. I'm just trying to run the fuck away. <laughs> get away from all the scary things.